You heard that rhythm? <laughs> I don't know, I just like to play around sometimes. Oh, Palacha Lock! Oh, Palacha, uh, um, I think that's a teleport tab, maybe? I can teleport directly, you touch the Serenic tablet, you feel a surge energy. Lassar echo in your mind, okay. Like this, you can use like this. Yeah, okay, wait, can you... Mm, uncharged. It can hold up to a thousand charges for each blood, soul, death, and law rune are used on the ring to provide one charge. So you need one of each, I guess. So just use the runes on the ring. How many would wish to add? So this is like a thousand teleports. The ring has very similar offensive stats to brimstone ring, making it a decent alternative. If lost, another one can be obtained by mysterious bandits in the ancient vault for 75,000 coins. There's a bunch of teleports like the Scar, which I should not be able to teleport, but I can now teleport straight to Lassar Undercity. I don't have to teleport with this stupid teleport Lassar and then run around. You know, the worst part about this is like when you teleport like usually to Lassar is uh, you teleport here, yeah? And this is the entrance. So you click the entrance. It doesn't go through here because clearly, well, it's blocked. So you have to walk like this, but no hands now, yeah? my character will stop at some point. That's like the biggest downside, that you cannot just one click and run. Maybe they're gonna change it. This is what you would refresh again. Click again, from then you can go in. But I'm gonna stop around here, anytime now. I think. Or was it my run energy running out? No, no, there you go. Yep, 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 yep. And it stopped like this. Don't have to do this anymore. And it's, it's so long also. You go inside, it takes you to come dozel place like this. And then you run all the way again, like stamina pots and all, like running. You can't even see the, the, the going down, like, you know. And then you get all the way to the rope. That's rope. Or you can just teleport. Where's my ring? Oh my god, I thought I lost it. I can teleport directly under the rope now. Instead of walking all this. Oh my god, yes. Easy boy. Wrong monkfish. 700. 221k. Watch this. Boom, 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 boom. Bo, that was perfect. <laughs> Only took like 30 KC to get used to that. Crush a bit of a longsword seven. <laughs> I got some Anka Truby's last kill was 84 Runai Bolt and finish. The drops are kind of like weird. I'm gonna show more of the drops as well, but Rune Light is not tracking anything right now, so it's kind of difficult. I wanted to transfer everything to my alt account, but then I forgot and then everything blended in. So I'll just show you a mix of uh, drops eventually. Now I want to show you how the kill goes. How it's. I'm probably gonna do this without any kind of food unless I mess up because when you're commentating, you know So I start with a curse scepter because it reduces defense But I'm actually not sure if it does because I haven't checked with lunars at all And this whole fight is basically a rhythm game and you will notice that in the end especially that's why I have the in-game sounds I hope that you can hear them properly compared to me because if they're too low that is bad Basically in the very beginning. It's easy. She always uses the same three attacks Three range or three magic. So, oh, now she's gonna do special attack, and you have to have this black stone fragment in your inventory. Oh, we're gonna do this one. Pow, 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 pow. I missed. You get the idea. It's it's a rhythm game. Just put yourself in the rhythm, and it's easy. Then she decides to freeze you. Ice barrage it. Ice barrage that bitch. Okay, oh, don't let your prayer run out. That was fast. Oh, move. That was quick reflection. You see that? Did I say reflection? <laughs> I can't commentate what I'm doing this live, <laughs> but I'm doing well, I think. Now, on the second one, she does two of the same, but the last one is different. Did you see that? So she does two range, one mage. Two mage, one range, something like that. And then you move. Listen to the rhythm. Watch this. Ah, she teleported too quick. Okay, another special attack she's doing. We're gonna activate the core again and look for the lowest HP, lowest, not the highest one. You don't wanna do the highest because you're gonna mess everything up. Then you go on the second lowest, not the highest, and then the highest one is the last. I made it now, I didn't even make it for the video, no. But now you know what happens when you don't make it, your sanity goes down, and I'm not even sure if I can get this kill, but we're gonna try anyway. Eyes barrage it, but don't make any mistakes because the more mistakes you, you do, the sanity goes down, and if sanity goes down to zero, you're dead, literally. You're not gonna make it. Okay, that was close. 
Okay, rhythm game. Yes, Dolby. Rhythm game. Listen to this. Watch this. Watch this. <clears throat> One, two, three, move. One, two, three, move. And soon, one, two, three, move. Soon she's gonna do another special attack. There we go. We're gonna activate this again and find a ghost that says Vito. There you go, Vito. Another one. There's only two always. Boom, done. I like to reapply the debuff, but I don't. I don't think it really does that much. She's gonna try to chase you now. So you're gonna wait. Don't do it immediately. Wait until she moves a little bit, then cast Ice Barrage. If you cast it too early, she will not be frozen. Now you gotta be very careful. Now this is the true the rhythm game. Watch this. One, two, three. That was a mistake, but look at this, no panic. One, two, three, boom. No panic, no panic. One, two, three, boom. Mm-hmm. No panic. One, two, three, boom. Boom, mm hmm no panic. One, two, three, walk, mm hmm One, two, three, walk, and activate the heart. One, two, three, oh, that's the final fight now. Ah, I did it a little bit wrong. <laughs> I couldn't finish it because I was commentating too much. Let me just show you how the end is supposed to be because I completely messed that up. So you may have noticed in this case, I teleported out, but why did you teleport out? You had food, you had prayer. I mean, sure you were low HP, maybe you were gonna get KO'd, but like, why, why would you teleport out if you pray correctly? Everything should have been fine. The problem was that I messed up so much in the fight because I was commentating, my sanity went to zero. That means if you don't dodge certain abilities, sanity goes down. Once it reaches zero, you're dead. You gain constant, five, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 damage like this every single game tick. Essentially meaning 0% sanity equals death. I killed it too fast, there was no rhythm. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I tried to make it, oh my god, it's the second one. Uh, a pro tip, if you want to have some death's coffer item, this is it. Because it is 2 million worth, as you can clearly tell, but the grand exchange value is like 1 mil. Actually, G average is now 2.2 mil, so I don't know what the hell happened and where is it even used for. It was 1 mil when I checked last time. So people were dumping this in the death's coffer because you buy it for 1 mil and you put it for 2 mil. So you're getting 2 mil in the coffer, but also getting like 10% extra. You know how the co coffers work? This is exactly what it does. Awakens orb items dropped by Leviathan, all the bosses basically. They used to access stronger awakened variants of the four bosses. Awakened bosses will have higher chances of unique drops than their standard variants, but it has been confirmed that killing awakened variants will not be an efficient means to acquire them. Rather, they will primarily be defeated for acquiring ancient blood ornament kits, which can be used on Torva armor to cosmetically enchant them. Okay, so it's like a uh, I don't know, TOB, uh, Cox, you know, to get, oh, sorry, wrong account. I'm, yep, I'm playing on two accounts, hell yeah. Brendan Gear, listen. Swap prayers. She's do two attacks the same. Another two attacks. Another two attacks with magic. Another two attacks with range. Another two attacks with magic. Another two attacks with range. Ooh, that was close, actually. Almost uh, missed. Ah, I took it off. Accident. Accident happened. Uh, what am I doing? Uh, this is what happens when you talk. Usually this is so smooth. Oh god, my prayers run out. Am I gonna die? Please, sir. Please, 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 please. please. <laughs> okay, we're good. <laughs> Make sure you have enough prayer before the final fight begins. And then, that was, that's the end. Ooh, we got it again. Third one in. 43 KC. In fact, like I still haven't banked since last time, so uh, yeah, I got uh, a couple of them. <laughs> okay, always choose. N okay, medium, highest, lowest. Start with lowest, then medium, and then highest. If I didn't explain that, uh, I, I forgot how I explained the last time. Boom. Montanai, prayer potion, ancient brew. Mm, thanks for prayer pot, I guess. Oh, and Mantarai. So more Adamant Ore, 100. More Adi Ore, 105. This Adi Ore is green, but barely 100k again, isn't it? 165 65 GP just for the green text. 
Mm, Rune Knight or 42, isn't that like actual half a million or something? Yeah, that is. Well, 467k, that's, I think it's the highest value drop that I got so far in 60kc, not counting those big drops. 70 battle stars, what are these drops? Like, I got 140 chaos runes, that was a single drop. And then I got like 70 battle stars, which is, I assume, half a mil. Yeah, 553. Five, oh, a green stack of soul runes, 259k. Mm. Uncut diamonds in the green text too. That's barely 100k. Watch. Boom. 126. What? 10 metro long swords this time. Some anti ores, metro ores, death runes, rune and bolts, metro long swords. Ooh, half a million worth of battle staffs once again. Okay, this is always my favorite one. One. Click, 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 click. No, miss. Click. Did I do that? No, I didn't. I did I? I'm. I, I think I lost like one game. Tick. I don't know. It's always fun. That 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 part is the the best. Oh, this is not the best though. What? What the hell is this? Uh, what? It did not even note it. <laughs> what in the hell? Look at the clan. Six six one point six mil. What? <laughs> Wait, how am I supposed to? Am I supposed to like eat my food? Yes, yes, eat the food, drop these. Mm -hmm, mm, time to rebank. <sighs> Suffering from success once again. Mm, that's actually way more add or what was it like 150 usually? Yeah, this is yeah, 152k worth. It's actually the 100 KC, I think, or is it 99? Can't tell. It is the 100th. And yeah, like a month today is the last, the final one. Okay, so. I can't show you the load, unfortunately, because it's not being tracked. But you saw most of it and you got a general idea. Now we got those orbs and I want to check the price first of all in the Grand Exchange. Oh yeah, oh my god, they're 3.6 mil each. What? They just keep going up in price. So, wait, is this like one orb per attempt? Like an over key or something? So those who are going to be hunting for those uh, Torva, the color kits, I mean, they probably have a lot of money. Well. I can't use these, apparently, yet, but we'll check it out because this is not the only video on these new bosses. Thank you guys for watching.